about Juju Smith, Shyster, and whatever his name. I know what his name is. He was. You, see, you don't know what his name is. It's it's Schuster, not Shyster. God, this guy's a bumbling idiot. He's a blowhard. He's a dwarf. Look at him. He doesn't shut up. Seventy-four minutes he's been on the air. He's talked for seventy-one minutes and taken three minutes of phone calls. Fun, man. That's, that's what these shows are about. This guy is a bumbling moron. I love it. I love you guys. I love the torture. But honestly, oh, you love it because you get a platform. You can just talk in circles for fucking an hour and fifteen minutes. You sure you're gonna love it? And nine times out of ten, in doing this job. You talk about new coaches. No, you talk about the we don't talk about it. You, you talk, talk about it because this show's all about you, Andre. It's all about you. The dysfunction is unreal. This guy's the equivalent of Hugh Jackson if in the radio talk show or television talk show. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Let, let him go on some more. And you wrote nothing but truth. This is supposed to, look, they got a phone number down here, Andre. You're supposed to take calls. Like, honestly, would you, you'd be like, oh, this, this is crazy. They did what? That happened? Your hand. You look like a moron with your hand. Like you're talking to your hand on television. A coach? You're talking to your hand on television. Look into the camera, Andre. A GM called down and told Look into the camera, Andre. God. How's this clown have a job? This isn't even real. But it is. So I ask you, how attractive oh is the Cleveland Browns job? Because I love, I love this talk because... Oh, this guy. How attractive. There's only, what, 33 jobs like this in the world? We've got first round pick high in the draft. We got all these draft picks. We got Nick Chubb. This guy's seriously on television right now. Two hours? We got, you know, we got, man, and we got great fans. There's a reason this guy's a local talk guy. Pay a lot of money. That sounds good. Oh my God. But a smart coach go, Blowhard. Dwarf. Right? Talking circles. Like, Kids out there, I know we got a lot of older gentlemen listening right now. Yeah, we're listening because we can't talk because you don't take Kids phone calls. Look at them thinking up there, like, oh, what do I say now? Have Talking in circles. To the person that's trying to hire you. You learn a lot about the company you're getting ready to walk into. I'm learning a lot about Sports Time Ohio because they employ you. They want to know who you are. But you better find out who you're trying to work for, too. Oh, my God. And I think any coach they need to get somebody else in the studio with them so they can talk, too, because this guy just talks in circles. It's the same thing every week. But there's so much more to it than that. Let's go to David. Oh, my God. He's taking a phone call. How are you tonight? Third one of the night. All right. How are you doing? I'm doing excellent, man. I'm sure you are. Well, I finally found somebody that agrees with me on the... Honestly, Sports Time Ohio, I don't know how you keep this guy employed. He might do a better job on it like the Indians, but he's just he's not meant for television because... When you have a show like this, you're supposed to look in the camera, not talk to your fucking hand, not talk fucking every second. You're supposed to take calls. And I don't care because I don't, I'm not going to call because I, I don't sit on hold for nobody. But I'd rather hear other people's opinions than this clown mumble for fucking hour and 15 minutes out of an hour and 20 show. So I'm, I got to change the channel. Dance. Oh, by the way, you mentioned my video yesterday because I don't need to make YouTube videos for hits and make fun of people. Andre, you know why? Because you do the same thing every week. You just keep talking and talking. I mean, look at this guy. He looks like Hugh Jackson. He's actually shorter than Hugh, too. <laughs> Dance.